I'm going to show you how to use your stencils. I'm going to show you things that you want to do and things that you want to avoid. So when we're using our stencils, we want to make sure that we keep them in one place. So our hands aren't that big. They can't cover the whole stencil at the same time without covering up the place where we need to color. So we're going to need to move our hand as we fill in our stencil. I'm gonna show you how to do this with the colored pencil first. So you wanna draw lightly and not press too hard. If you press too hard, your pencil might slip underneath of your paper. So right now I'm coloring around the side that I'm holding down because I know that it won't move. But this part seems like it can move a little bit because my hand's not on it. So I might need to turn my hand so that way I'm holding another part of my stencil. Make sure this side's down all the way. Then I'm gonna keep turning my hand so that way I make sure that each spot is being held down and it won't slip when I'm coloring it. If you feel like there's a part you might have missed, you can go around the edges to try and get that shape. You might even want to go back and make it darker now that you've got your shape there. When you remove your paper, you'll have your shape nice and neat. Now I'm gonna show you some things that you don't wanna do with your stencil. So, I don't wanna to push too hard because I might rip my paper. And if I rip my paper, then it's gonna be pretty hard to use my stencil. But it's okay, you can fix this. So you can use a stapler or some tape. I'm gonna bend it back together. Try to fix it. You don't have to start over and make a completely new stencil. Okay, so You'll put it back together and then start over. Another thing you want to avoid is slip your pencil under your paper. It's easy to do this if you're not holding down your paper as you work. For example, if I'm holding down my paper over here, but not over here, then I just go to color, my pencil might slip under and then it doesn't quite look right. Okay, so you wanna make sure that you stay inside the lines the best that you can. Draw lightly, don't press too hard as you color your stencil.